Hey guys, Ben Scripps and Inverts. Um, doing a complete reptile collection update. Just moving the lights into a good position. Um, I'm going to start off with my two coastals. Um, this one that's following me around is a bit snappy. And then we've got the other one just poking its head out at the moment. It's not so snappy. Um, so, they're not housed together. I just I got this one out while still in the hide because um, just the way the hide's made, she stays in it when it comes out. And then I got him out by himself, put him there, so he came in and hid with her. Um, they're both over a metre now. Well, at least approaching a metre. Um, yeah, so that's them. Here's my beauty. Um, gorgeous girl. I'm actually kind of worried about her because she's slowed down on her eating and isn't coming out of her hide all that often. So, I just hope she's not dying. Because that'd be horrible. She's a gorgeous girl. Hey, eh? she's not very um wanting to have a play. She's got some scar tissue from nose rub in her previous enclosure. But apart from that, she just looks absolutely gorgeous. All right, this is my blue tongue. Love their big heads. Beautiful. Okay, um, not much to say about this guy. Try to get a close up with his head. Bad lighting, but here we are. That looks alright. Alright. Uh, yeah. Last but certainly not least is my, um, Stimson's python. Um, not sure if you're getting the iridescence there, but it looks beautiful. <laughs> um, these guys stay relatively small, um, about a meter, meter and a half for a big one. I just don't want you going in there, so let's chuck you back in your enclosure. Um, I didn't include my frogs because they're not reptiles or Scyther because he's outside. That's my bread life. Um, and yeah, that's it. Hope you enjoyed. Comment, rate, and subscribe.